Hello there, I am Giant Grold with my Pokemon Emerald. In the last part, we took on the whole, you know, the trainers in Sutapio's gym, the eighth and final gym. So, and now we're going to take on Guan, the gym leader. So if I can do this puzzle correctly, that'd be awesome. Hopefully I do on my first try. It's not that big of a deal if I mess up because I battle all the trainers anyway. So, it's about, this like video is basically dedicated to like me taking on Guan. So, you know. Hopefully I won't goof this up though. I think I got the third one. Gotta take it slow and steady. I think I got this. See, if you step on each one of these tiles twice, it'll fall. You'll fall through though. See, that's his trick. So you can only step on each tile once, and you have to complete all the tiles to get it. So here's Guan. Who do I have up front? Who do I have up front? I have Shrooms up front. Uh, I'll put um, Speedy up front, I guess. Let me ask you, did you know? And ah, I should not be so coy. It was I who, it was I who taught Wallace everything there is to know about Pokemon. Once I have given up my position as the gym leader, in my place, I had entrusted Wallace with the gym. However, a compelling reason arose for me to make a comeback. Ah, but enough chatter. Let us begin with our match, shall we? Please, you should bear witness to our artistry. A grand illusion of water sculpted by Pokemon and myself. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think he starts off with a love disc. A love disc. So, let's see. He has some good fashion sense right there. I'm just gonna thunderbolt it. Nothing big. I should do a lot of damage. I hope. Yep, about half. Okay, a little bit over half. So, yeah. Oh, attract. I think I have the red food on me. If, I'm gonna use the red food on me just in case. So, yeah. Bag. Yep, red food, okay. Yeah, Speedy got over um being in love. Yep, that's pretty cool. I'm gonna use the Thunderbolt now. It should faint the love disc, that's awesome. Wish cash, huh? Okay. Let's go to Shrooms then. Sh uh Wish Cash only has one weakness. Because it's water and ground, but it, it's four times worked to grass type moves. That's why I'm bringing in shrooms. So let's see how much the Giga Drain does or something. It should one. This could one hit KO it at least, because Giga Drain is a really powerful grass type move. Four times. Wish Cash is four times worked up. It, but I was being I was being too cocky. I was I'm being way too cocky right now. I mean, yeah. Um. I'm just gonna use a four store hyper push or something. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, Mach punch it, just to weaken down, just to make sure it weakens down. I, I you know get rid of that little bit of health that I need, and then I'm gonna go for the Giga Drain again. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay, so I'm gonna go for Giga Drain, and this should um when it this should KO it now, and I should have all my HP back too. So that's a win win. Yeah, KO'd it, and I got all my HP back. Nice. It's like I'm psychic or something, guys. No, I can just do predictions really easily when I, when I have enough information. Yeah. Uh, uh, Celio. Um. Hmm. Celio. I forgot, what does Prime have on its moveset? Roll out. I'm gonna try to. Well. I could just keep Shrooms in for because I get same type attack bonus for fighting type moves since Shrooms is the grass I'm fighting I believe, and I'm gonna choose the Sky Cut. So I believe Celio is half Ice type, so it should be super effective. There we go, awesome, nice. We're rolling, we're ro we're rolling along here. How awesome is that, Kingdra? Okay, uh, the, the only thing Kingdra is weak to is. At least in this generation, I believe, because in the sixth generation, 
uh, with Kalos. There's a fairy type, of course, and Dragon is weak to fairy, I believe, in that generation, and so on. But for third generation, Kingdra is only weak against uh, is is only weak against Dragon type moves because it's part Dragon. It's Dragon and Water, so I can't even use the Ice type moves. I don't have any Dragon type moves. I'm pretty sure I don't have any Dragon type moves. Which is a pump, which is a bummer. Yeah, I don't have any dragon type moves. That's what I look at. So what I'm gonna do is what am I gonna do? I'll keep shrooms in. I want to weaken down this Kingdra because it's a really big pain in the butt. So yeah, I'm gonna try. To I'm gonna do the leech seed on it first. Oh, I was gonna use get double team. I was gonna use double team. Okay, that's actually pretty strategic. But I still hit with the leech seed. Okay. So there we go. And we're gonna get some HP back too if we take any damage. But for right now, I'm fully healed on my shrooms. That sounded weird. Um, let's try Mach Punch. I know it won't do much, but it won't do much at all because <laughs> because it well it missed. Okay, this Kingdra is being a pain in the behind. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch out to. I'll switch out to I'll switch out to um prime because prime's also water type Pokemon ice beam okay see it's not gonna do much hopefully see how much it does it does it did 10 HP okay that's a big difference then almost knocking out shrooms earlier and then leech seed will make it fully healed so that's a, this is a, this is actually working out fairly well with the leech seed going too I actually Come on! <laughs> I'm sorry if I was loud there in my commentary, but I was like, I wasn't expecting rest. It's gonna use its, uh, ch chesto berry too, right? Yeah. I wish you can't use that again because you already used that move. And, well, it misses again, okay. This is just gonna be a what the heck battle. It really helps against this Kingdra if you have a dragon type move. Maybe, maybe even just, you know, your subtile having a, um, dragon claw move from, um, Meteor Falls, if you remember where to get that team. I think I may have showed it, I may have not showed it yet. Oh, wait. well then again, you can't use Waterfall until after you use, uh, after you get this gym badge, say it's gym badge. So, it's okay, a Hyper Potion, of course. So basically, you can't even get Dragon Claw the TM, I don't think, until after this battle. Jeez, that's irony. That's irony, that's finest. Okay, I'm confused. I'm going to use the Elf, the Elf with the next turn. I almost got the full HP from that one. Okay. Let's get use Rust. Okay, of course. This is just an annoyance Pokemon once you figure out what's good against it. It won't resist its well. I woke up again. It's gonna use Rust. No! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, Kingdra? Seriously? So close. It's so close to being fainted. Oh no, it woke up. It woke up. No! It woke up just in time. This is so annoying. So now it's gonna use rest on the next turn, because it's in the red. I knew it! I called it! I so called it! Jeez. Come on! It's gonna have like a little bit of red HP. Probably next turn it's probably gonna wake up. I probably jinxed myself. Yeah, I called it. I called it. See, like, it gets down to this red health right here. The leech, she takes it, and there's a little tiny bit of, you know, red left, and then it wakes up. You kidding me? How many? How many? How much PP is rest? I thought it was only like five or ten PP. Jeez. Yeah, stay asleep for one more turn. If you wake up this turn, I'm gonna go like crazy and stuff. And you don't. I just. I don't. I want to go crazy. You just wake. It's just not fair. You wake up at the right time. I knew that I didn't have any. Well, I didn't know for sure, but like I had a feeling I didn't have any dragon type moves. Dragon type moves, and I do. I. I mean, I don't. See, that's what makes it so difficult. I'm just have to wither away with health. It's like the, that's like the, at least the fifth or fourth or fifth time you've done that, Kingdra. I just I had quick attack right there. I could have. Yeah. Hopefully, if when means when you do ice beam like that, that means you're out of rest. Hopefully, and it looks like you are because I um just finally fainted you. Fainted that Kingdra. Yes, it's, the experience is splits it splits three ways, maybe four ways, but that's okay. Prime is now level forty, which is awesome. Crawdon. Okay, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back to Shrooms. 
Crawdance, Water, and Dog type, so like a Fine type move would be awesome. It's super effective on it. You know, Grass and Electric for the Water type move, so you have plenty of different weaknesses for this one. Giga Drain, yes. I go first apparently, so I'll just take it. Okay, one more Giga Drain. Hopefully this Karadon doesn't like faint with a crap oh crap hammer. Gee, this crap hammer is pretty powerful. But since I resist it, it didn't do as much as I thought. Cool. And then there we go. Nice. Okay, now that that's over with. That's probably like one of the longest battles of my life. <laughs> probably not in my life, but you know, it's a long battle. Level 43 for shrooms, nice. Shumer Gron, ahaha, excellent, very well, you are the winner. From you, I sense the brilliant shine of skill that we overcome, that will overcome all. However, compared with me, or even Wallace, you are lacking in elegance. Perhaps I shall make you a loan to uh, my outfit? Haha, <laughs> I merely jest. Rather than my clothes, I shall reward you with this, the rain badge. Thanks for the $92, man. We got the we got the rain badge from Quan, and I'm pretty sure I'm still, you know, I'm saying his name on Guan or Quan or Guan. <laughs> rain badge is something a uh, full absence of all your Pokemon of, to your command. Sorry, I miss I skipped through half the dialogue. The rain badge will also use the HM move waterfall to scale wall or walls of crusading water. And yes, so there is never forget this. But okay, CM3, which is water pulse, I believe. Wonderful shit. Yeah. And the use of it yeah. Okay. We get we register him in the Pokemon app, and as we do we just exit the gym, we just drop through the floor right here. And we keep on going down these little icy things. There we go. Uh let's see I wanna see my final move sets for some of them. Come on. Because none of them have reached my well I only think of a couple of which the final move sets. And bullet strength. Okay, that's good. That's the final move set. That's the final move set. That's the final move set. That's not the final move set. That's the final move set. Okay, so everyone's meet. Everyone's reached their final move set now, except for um, you know, my Flareon, my Knight. Okay, let's talk to the best giver. What? Yeah, you beat an even Quan, who is supposedly the best in all Hoenn. Okay, check your trainer card. If you got to know the, if you got all the gym badges, you're so except for the Pokemon League challenge. Okay, so if we go to a poker card or trainer card, we get all the badges now, which is awesome. So that's awesome. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna train off screen for Rayquaza because I just don't think I'm ready for catching Rayquaza because we still have to go back and do that. But I'm gonna fly back to specific lockdown. And yeah. I don't, I don't know exactly where I'll train, but like, maybe in Sp Sp uh, Sky Pillar or something, I don't know. Okay, so next time you'll see me, well, these levels will be a bit higher. I'm thinking, hmm, thinking like level 40, level 45. Yeah, that seems good. So like, six levels for Blaine, five levels for Knight. Um, hold on. Uh, five levels for Prime, I can think there. Um, three levels for Peter, two levels for Shrooms, and three levels for Speedy. Level 45 should be okay. And if... I believe my Laron's supposed to evolve into its final evolution soon, so... I mean, it's... Wait, my, I'm not sure that's like a... Maybe not train him, but past level... Uh, depending on my level. I think he evolves to level 42, so like, I'll only train Knight up to level 42 then. Or level 41 and almost level 42, just so I can see the evolution and all that. So yeah. Other than that, I think that's about it. So this has been then my Pokemon Mode walkthrough guide part. In the next part, we'll take on Rayquaza as a rematch and hopefully catch it, you know? Now that we'll have a stronger Pokemon, like, level-wise. So this has been John Go again. I really like the name of again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon Emerald walkthrough guide.